Today I'm bringing you my first part of the America vlogs. If you don't know, I went to America for three weeks with my boyfriend Dan. I'll just do a quick run through of where we went if you're interested. We went to New York first, we flew to Las Vegas, we then hired a car and drove from there to Yosemite National Park, then we drove to San Francisco, we then drove down the coast, stopped in three places, Monterey, Cambria, Santa Barbara, and we finished at Los Angeles. Yeah, we did three weeks of that, and it was amazing, and I videoed all three weeks for you, and I will be bringing them to you, I think it'll be in three parts, but this one is definitely the first part. I'm just introducing all of them for you, just so you have a bit of an idea what went on. So yeah, I hope you enjoy them, and please subscribe and like, etc. And don't forget to follow me on Twitter, at Faye Says. So yeah, enjoy! I did a little bit of vlogging of the airport etc but we have actually arrived in New York now I sort of skipped a bit out because it was a bit stressful we had to get the we didn't have to but we decided to get a subway just because it's cheaper than trying to get a taxi so we had to get a subway which is actually okay we think it was easier than doing the tube and now, now we're here and the hotel's okay it was pretty cheap so we're not that fast although I don't know if you can hear that but that's the window which is basically open um, it's got a massive hole through it but we're just going to decide what we're going to do now um, probably nothing too exciting because we are a bit tired we just got to Central Park and we decided to come now because it's still quite sunny and it's really really nice and everyone's just chilling out um, I think we're just going to carry on exploring <laughs> the vlog off properly yesterday because um <laughs> because we were very tired we'd been up for like 24 hours so um we just went to central park where like i shot some stuff and then what else did we actually do oh, oh we went fifth to avenue. applebee's which was all right oh yeah we went to fifth avenue uh and today we're gonna head downtown and hopefully go to the um was it ground zero yeah ground zero and maybe try and get on a boat to Statue of Liberty but who knows. Because <laughs> we didn't. Why and then didn't we? Um, we went Back to no. Then we years. went to Union Square Park. Is that what it's called? Yeah. yeah. Then we went to Union Square Park, which was quite nice. And we just chilled, and now we're here just chilling. And um, everyone is queuing up for Shake Shack, which is this like cool burger place. But I don't think we'll do it because the queue is too long. But um, I'm not sure what we're going to do now. We might just sort of try and find somewhere to eat or something. That is the Empire State Building up there. And it looks really nice in the sun. We're not very far from here, so I thought we'd just walk it. Didn't we, Dan? We're just going to walk it. Let's go. 
We are just getting ready now to go out for dinner. I think we're just going to have something easy like TGI. Then we might go to Times Square or possibly Rockefeller Centre. We're not quite sure yet. But um, we've seen on the news that it might have a um, storm Friday on Saturday, which won't be very good because that'll be our last night and morning. So I really hope it's not too bad and that the city doesn't stop for it. So fingers crossed. and oh no it's day three isn't it it's day three um i didn't actually finish off last night's vlog because i was very very tired um but we went to you'll see that we went to the top of the rock to see it at night and then we went to times square so that was really good and then today i think we're maybe going to do the high line and something else but we're going to go get breakfast first so yes let's go ready dad are you ready <laughs> Yeah. High line now. Um, it's not very sunny, which is really annoying. But at least we're not going to get burnt. Um, yeah, it's pretty pretty. But we went to the High Line, which was a really, really nice walk. And then we went to Five Guys, which was really yummy. And then we just sort of went to Central Park. Um, and Dan bought me a Tiffany ring. Um, it was like a belated 21st birthday present. So um, I'm really pleased with that. I'll show you now. It's really, really simple, but I just wanted something quite simple. It doesn't want to autofocus, but yeah, it's just sort of like a nice leafy ring. So yeah, I'm very happy and I'm not sure what we're going to do now, we might go to Broadway. So we didn't do anything too exciting tonight, we were trying to find some tickets but they were quite expensive but we might try again tomorrow. We went to the Hard Rock Cafe but it wasn't really worth the money. Where did we also go? Where did we go? H&M. And we went to H&M because it is now starting to rain in New York. Tropical storm. Yeah, and hopefully it's not going to turn into the storm like they've said. So we both bought one of these lovely items, including the hood to go with it. And they were only five dollars, and they are very practical, but they are absolutely ugly. Uh, so we just walked back from Times Square, both wearing these and looking fabulous. So I'll end today's vlog, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs> it is our last day today, and it is raining. Um, quite badly and they're sort of doing flood warnings around New York but I don't think it's that bad compared to us our English weather so um, we're just gonna try and hopefully carry on our day we're gonna go and get breakfast at Prept again and then probably gonna go to Grand Central to have a look just because it's indoors we're gonna be wearing our sexy anoraks again and um, yeah hopefully we don't get too wet <laughs> Grand Central and I did do a bit of vlogging there and then we decided to queue in Times Square in the rain for about an hour well it was more than an hour to get some tickets for tonight because it's our last night and we thought we would just do something and um, we ended up spending more than we wanted to but we thought we'd been in the queue for about an hour we're gonna go see once which is meant to be really good so I'm quite excited about that so we're both absolutely drenched and it's just awful it's not that heavy out there but it's just constant and we were walking around New York in those ponchos. A couple of people asked us where they were from though, didn't they? 
and a couple I did hear a couple of people go, Oh ponchos, so they obviously looked amazing. So we are about to brave the horrible rain to go and see the show, which I'm excited about, but I don't really want to have to go for all the rain to get there. Dan's just got ready. Um, and we're gonna have to try and find somewhere to eat before we get there, so hopefully it's not too stressful and hopefully we don't have to walk too much in the rain. But it is just chucking it down. It's been like it all day, so fingers crossed. Yeah. Ending today's vlog, which is actually the end of our New York time. We are off to Vegas tomorrow, which is very exciting, and I think we're sort of ready for it. We're fed up with this rain and. Um, just sort of having to wear our ugly anoraks everywhere but it's meant to be so hot in Las Vegas it's sort of 48 44, 44 degrees which is a loads for us um, but that's quite exciting tonight we went to see Once in Broadway which was really really good and I loved it and um, so that was a really nice end to our trip so I will take you on our journey tomorrow possibly to Vegas you know what your we have just arrived, well, recently arrived in Las Vegas, and we're in our hotel, which is the Cheesy Luxor, uh, which, if you don't know, is the base, it's like the pyramid shape, and we'd heard quite a lot of sort of rough things about it, but this is our room, and I don't think it's too bad, there's me in the mirror, TV, nice, uh, authentic wardrobe there, Dan, and our bed is pretty massive, actually if we uh, spanned out on it. But yeah, now I think we're just gonna try and do a bit of an investigation around just our hotel, just because it's absolutely like huge here. Um, and it's just something that we're not really used to, but it should be interesting. I think we're either gonna love it or we hate it, but we shall see. It's actually outside our room, which is crazy. Wow. Yeah. And there are all, all the rooms in there. Absolutely mental. and we are going out now um i had a bit of a nap because just so mega tired kind of like three hours ahead so i'm about ready for bed but we have to go out and it's so hot out there so i'm just sort of trying to um prolong going out in it i thought i'd show you what i'm wearing which is just this primark top and primark skirt then what are you wearing top and shorts all saints top are they all saints yeah are they? And we're both wearing flip flops just because it's so hot and look at our room already. What a tip. So we are going out. Ta da! So we have been for breakfast this morning, and you would have seen that I had the most unhealthy choice possible. I had chocolate pancakes with cream on top. I did ask for no marshmallows though, because that would have been a bit too much. Dan probably has the most healthy of the breakfasts. And now we are going to go to the pool, um, we have booked a trip to the Grand Canyon tomorrow, but we did it online, so um, it could be a bit hit or miss whether we actually booked it properly. So um, I probably won't take this down to the pool, we did see the pool in the clip earlier. So yeah, I will show you again what we do later. So we went to the pool for a couple of hours, which was really nice. It, the heat wasn't too bad because we could get in the shade and in the pool so that was quite nice now we're gonna have an early dinner i think it's what's time half four. half four so we're gonna have quite an early dinner because we thought we'd have i don't know why have we decided to do that because we're having a snack later on and then we're gonna have a snack later on oh yeah because we haven't had lunch so we thought we'd just have like a big dinner so i might show you that whatever we get um and then we're going to try and explore later hopefully it won't be too hot and hopefully i can handle it unlike last time we had dinner which was really really nice 
and I had a burger which was pretty unhealthy but we also had salad which was a nice change we have now just got ready to go out to see the fountain display which is really really good and this morning we are up at six o'clock well earlier than that to go to the Grand Canyon on a 14 hour coach trip um, which I'm really excited about but hopefully it's not too painful the journey so woo but now I'm hungry and thirsty bad times <laughs> Just come back from the Grand Canyon. I've realised that the patient really have been allowed down there actually. Naughty face. Yesterday we went to the Grand Canyon, you would have seen that. Today is our last day in Las Vegas and last night. We literally have just been by the pool today, but it's been really nice, um, but I didn't obviously vlog that. Now we are going out for dinner, and then we're probably going to go for a bit of shopping, come back, then go out again later just to do the strip sort of one last time. Okay, I'm just about to lose my money playing blackjack, but I'm only putting a dollar in. Meanwhile, I've got seven dollars. Right. Dan's not going to tell me what I'm doing this time. So... What does Queen mean? Tells you what you got up there. Oh, okay. It's a 10, oh, 20. A yes, I won! I got two, two! I'm going to deal again. Or I'm going to deal again. You're going to hit, you mean? Hit. 17. Nah! <laughs> we had dinner at the same place uh, that we did the other day because we really enjoyed it and Dan wanted to watch the sports on the telly. I've got changed because I thought I might as well just be a bit dressy up as it's Vegas and it's the last night. And I'm wearing this dress, which is just a plain white skater dress, which is a bit crinkled. Uh, but then I thought I would be a bit more cash and I wore bands. <laughs> <laughs> 